live in New York, and my, my name was uh, Peter. Um, so, so, yeah, it was Peter, and um, yeah, and so I had to move here because I had so many enemies. Lots and lots of enemies. Um, yeah, so that's why I live in Chicago now. So I figured living in Chicago, I would do everything the exact opposite ways when I lived in New York. So for instance, instead of taking the subway, I take the L. See? Are you following me? Very good. And it's down and up. Those are opposites. I know my opposites. I can't tell time. But I know my opposites. So, very good. And then also I figured, you know, when I was in New York, I dated red-headed Irish girls, so now I, I like brunette Italian girls. So, exact opposite. Woo! All right, all right. And then I was a big Yankees fan in New York, so I became a Cubs fan. And she was a Cubs. But you got to do things the exact opposite, right? I mean, the team hasn't won in over 100 years. A lot of stuff has happened in the past 100 years. Do you realize that when the Cubs won the World Series, that women did not have the right to vote? So, good for you girls, you beat the Cubs in, in winning the World Series. You got to vote before they won it again. The following people have been presidents. Teddy Roosevelt, Howard Taft, Woodrow Wilson, Warren Harding, Calvin Coolidge, Herbert Hoover, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, Harry S. Truman, Dwight Eisenhower, John F. Kennedy, Lyndon B. Johnson, Richard Nixon, Gerald Ford for a short period of time, Jimmy Carter, Ronald Reagan, George Bush, Bill Clinton, George Bush Part Two, and now Barack Obama. That's a lot of presidents. Some things were invented since the Cup in the World Series like recording equipment. Do you realize that no one has ever heard the words, the Cubs win the World Series? Because the technology to record it was not invented yet. My favorite one though, Velcro. Velcro is younger than the Cubs. The concept to figure out how to buckle someone's shoe is younger than the Cubs' drought of winning a championship. I find that pretty amazing. And then my favorite one, communism in Russia began and ended after the Cubs won the World Series. That's a losing streak, my friends. I don't know how else to find it. So, very good. All right, well, like I said, I was from New York, and I feel like I can trust you now that it's been here a few times that you, you see me on stage. And are there any evil geniuses in the audience, perhaps? It, oh, okay, you are? You are? All right, good. Dr. Doom, are you here? No? No? Dr. Strange, are you here? Uh, Dr. Phil, are you here? Me, okay, good. All right, well, give me a moment, and I can reveal to you who exactly I am. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Last time, the strippers were in the audience. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't need the glasses, I can see. <laughs> now, one thing that's really annoying that people don't know about being a superhero, you have no idea how many pairs of pants I've lost over the years. You change in the middle of a big city, and your, your pants could be anywhere. It's either thrown on the floor, I mean, it's hard to find your clothes. I mean, you got people following you around going, it's gonna change. It's gonna change. Get his shoes! Get him! Get him! See, where are my shoes? There they are. Okay. Now, that especially happens on the Jersey Shore, because those guys will steal anything. There it is. All right, very good. Yeah, the people always ask me, have you ever fought the situation? And I said, of course I fought the situation. Let me tell you a little about him, though. All this here, a lot of compensation. He goes to get Spider-Man, it's domination. And there's a lot of humiliation over there. So that's what he's like. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now, I also fought Snooki once, too. 28 days out of the month, she's a piece of cake. But two days out of the month, you're putting in overtime for that. Come on, take it down. There you go. Good. Right. Now, people always ask me when I, when I do a bit like this, can you shoot your webs for us, please, please, please? 
And I say, you know, I could, you know, blast my webs off for you. <laughs> but then I already get all sticky. They don't particularly smell very good. And I really like to save them for when it really counts. Because I want optimal performance when I'm coming to your rescue. That's right. Very good. Now, another thing people always ask me when I'm out here on a situation like this. Do I like kissing up down, upside down in the rain? Huh? Well, as a matter of fact, I do. So, any takers? That's weird. I'm not Aquaman. <laughs> Thank you for letting me reveal a little bit about myself tonight, and have a great rest of your show.